So I recently ordered a few movie box sets. The first one was Barbie. I honestly wasn't anticipating being interested in seeing a Barbie movie. I've always really been more of a She-Ra Princess of Power kind of guy. But the approach to it really intrigued me and I really ended up enjoying it. It was super weird and existential and appealed to my dark sense of humor. How could I not love irrepressible thoughts of death, Barbie? Do you guys ever think about dying? I think I had two favorite movies from 2023 and Barbie was one of them. The other was Cobweb, which is a very different kind of film. I'm absolutely gonna do a whole video about the Barbie movie at some point. So I don't have much to say about the movie itself here. I love the case, it looks like a Barbie doll in her box. I don't know if there's an American version of this collector set. It looks like mine might be from Ireland. It says it's region free, I don't know if that applies to the DVD as well. But I did recently get an all region Blu-ray player, I'll make a video about that sometime too. It has this little box with art cards and posters in it. It's clearly based on the double doors on Barbie's dream house in the movie. Welcome to Barbie's dream house, come on in. Pictures online made it look a little nicer. I have a Jurassic Park Trilogy DVD set that it looks like the gates to the park, and you open it up with the doors. So I was hoping that would also be the case here. No pun intended. It seems like a missed opportunity to not have it open that way, but it's not that big of a deal. What's important is the movie itself. In addition to having the movie on Blu-ray and DVD, this set also comes with the soundtrack on CD. It's been a while since I've bought a CD. Maybe I'll listen to it the next time I've got irrepressible thoughts of death. Do I hear the pitter-patter of little feet? <gasps> the other box that I got was this Chucky collection. A good guy! I knew it! Hi, <laughs> I'm Chucky. He's something, isn't he? I think I've seen the first Child's Play movie, but I'm not sure. I don't really remember it. I do remember always seeing the VHS covers for the earlier films in the horror section of the video store when I was a kid, and being thoroughly creeped out by them. I always hear about how self-aware the Chucky movies are. Self-awareness is a valuable quality in a person, and I think it can be a good quality in movies too. I'm quite fond of Brad Dourif, who voices Chucky. No matter what! Barbie and his characters can range from really sympathetic to total creeps, which he's very good at playing. I also like Jennifer Tilly, and I know she's in some of the later ones. Well, hello, Dolly. Barbie, eat your heart out. I thought the case for the Barbie movie looked good, but the Chucky one looks even better. There's a holographic image, so it's 3D, so it looks like Chucky is actually in the box. I have multiple different horror movie box sets like this. I'm happy to add this one to the collection and I'm excited to finally check out the Chucky series. There's nothing innocent about child's play. I know they've made a TV series now as well that's a continuation of the movies. I've heard it's really good, so if I enjoy the movies I'll have to check out the TV series too. I love that the cover art for both box sets looks like the toy dolls and their packaging. They go really well together. Believe it or not, this wasn't planned. This is no accident. Nobody believes you about Chucky. I happened to have both of them on my wish list and didn't even think of the similarity until I had them in my cart. And when I noticed, I knew I had to make a video. So now that I'm all dolled up with nowhere to go, I'm gonna go watch some movies. Thank you for watching and have a good night. Good night, Chucky. Good night, Barbies. I'm definitely not thinking about death anymore.